This AC690 Pro video introduces the machine with a basic overview and explanation of the control panel and keypad functions. For mobility, the machine has two lockable 360-degree rotating front casters, inflatable rear wheels, and push handle. Two service hoses with R134A service couplers are located on the side of the machine. When not in use, hoses should be stored as shown. This is the liquid refrigerant valve, which controls flow to the output fitting during the flushing process. The rear tray can be used to store the user manual, personal protection equipment, thermometer, leak detector and torch. It is important to ensure that the machine is not connected via a mains extension lead longer than 7.5 meters and a conductor cross-section of no greater than 2.5 millimeters per core. The on-off isolator switch is located on the back of the machine above the rear tray. On the side of the machine, a magnetic protective shield protects the oil injection, UV dye injection and used oil drain bottles, each of which has different fittings to ensure correct installation. The bottles have scale increments marks to measure fluid injected or drained. There are also electronic scales to weigh the oil injection and oil drain bottles. Two panel valves control the flow of refrigerant in and out of the machine. They are opened and closed as prompted during different processes. Both valves should be kept closed when the machine is not in use. The machine has three gauges. The smallest one indicates the internal storage vessel pressure and used mainly for diagnostic purposes. It does not indicate the amount of refrigerant in the internal storage vessel. The blue gauge is a compound gauge for both vacuum and low side pressure. The red gauge shows the high side pressure of the vehicle's AC system. The printer outputs a hard copy of servicing process. Its use is explained in other videos. Once switched on, the LCD screen displays date and time and is used to show operator prompts, information displays, and the status of each process. The alphanumeric keypad is used to make selections and inputs for each process. Some keys have a dual function. Symbols represent specific processes and as arrow or navigation keys are used for selections shown on the LCD display. The green snowflake key activates a manual refrigerant recovery. The up arrow and red V key activates a manual vacuum. The right arrow and red snowflake key activates a manual charge. The left arrow and rotating circle key activates the fully automatic process. The down arrow and U-bend key activates flushing. The menu key accesses performance tests, diagnostic, tank filling, tank recycling, zeroing oil scales, and report management. Each of these are explained in the relevant videos. The car icon key accesses the integral vehicle database. The circular blanking cap is removable to enable a key to be inserted for database updates. The enter key confirms on-screen prompts and, if pressed with the time and date showing, will display the scale weights of refrigerant, oils and dye. The stop button cancels an incorrect selection to stop a process in mid-cycle or to complete a process when prompted. This completes the AC690 Pro introductory program.